Xenotransplantation has advantages in two ways. One, the almost unlimited source of, of material. And, and that, of course, is a significant problem when one thinks about organ transplantation. There's an ever-growing list of patients waiting for organs for transplantation. We're basically creating a stealth organ. We're tricking the immune system. The immune system of the human is going to look at this pig organ and think that it's just another human organ based on the new genetics of that organ. Hello, Lucille. If there were no other way, well, I guess I'd have to be in favor of it then because uh, the chances of survival without a transplant are very slim. Could we get on the office soon or just this afternoon? Or well, as a matter of fact, in about 15 minutes, there's a... Um, oh, there's a... Yeah, how you doing? And no one can be absolutely certain that there will not be transmission of these viruses, but uh, considering the severity of the diseases that we're treating, when you try to balance the risk and the benefit, uh, most people in this field uh, believe that the, the risk of the transmission of infection is considerably less than the potential benefit that we would get from this kind of work. Yeah. It was very little. I, I, I probably didn't even know what they were, uh, two boys and a girl. Oh, okay. Children. As far as um, if it would work or not, I'm sure everybody on this waiting list would be happy to know that something worked. Just extend your life just a little longer.